Hi Brian, I wanted to uh, send you another video of a, an updated, upgraded version of the force sensing resistor haptic feedback. So I made another one, very similar to the last, uh, clear acrylic case, cantilevered uh, with these standoffs in between there. In this case, the magnets are fixed to the bottom, and so the moving bit has the more lightweight printed circuit boards and the force sensor. And um, interestingly, while I'm sitting here programming this device, of course, I'm using my MacBook Pro, and realize that this essentially is the click I want to go for, which is the trackpad on my MacBook Pro. So I've been programming this and while I'm at uh, 24 volts here, so a little bit more substantial uh, action, the feel is very similar and I realize what gives me that feel is that what I'm doing is I'm uh, when the when the sensor exceeds the threshold I have selected uh, I send out a three millisecond pulse to each solenoid wired the same way they were yesterday in series uh, so I send out a three millisecond pulse followed by an off time a wait period of 50 milliseconds and then another one millisecond pulse and it's really interesting what that does as soon as you uh, you apply those sort of two pulses it feels very mechanical and I've got to say this feels very much like what it feels like to press my trackpad again like I said it's a little bit more forceful but I can easily just turn that down by knocking the voltage down to 15 or something like that so very interesting and the timing and the sequencing of the on pulses so while I was set up here, I also thought I'd give you another little demo because um, I think I've told you in the past how these do a pretty good job serving as speakers as well. So I've set up a little speaker demo for you here running off of a 9, nine volt battery. So that is just the exact same input. Instead now I've switched over to the to the speaker, or sorry, this is just an output of a little tiny amplifier I built. And uh, I think that indicates the dynamic response. That's all for now.